Javier Botet plays Slenderman, and he, he is the star of the show. This character is everything totally covered, so I was using my body. I have a quality that allows me to make extremely weird movement, and I can express regular things, but a little bit more creepy, special, different way, and this is amazing for Slenderman. You need somebody who's really gonna be able to create character with their movement, with their bodies, and there's nobody really better than Javier. He's told me himself that he felt like he was born to do this role. Javier is so talented with his body. He's playing this monster, this awful character, and he's so sweet. And then as he goes there. <laughs> <laughs> it's so nice when you meet someone so sweet who's playing such a creepy character. I think everybody can speak a lot about Slenderman because everybody can have a different opinion and sensation about what it is. He's different for everybody, like he's Slenderman. He's a figure in the woods and he's kind of this mystical creature, but he sort of targets your weaknesses and kind of gets in your brain. Rolling! Rolling! The backdrop is Slenderman, but it's really about these relationships between these girls. All these girls, honestly, I really love the group that we have, just like the vibe that we have and hanging out and it's just been like really fun. We're playing best friends, so being able to have a real bond with people is so special and important. <laughs> Four girls, Slender Man, chaos ensues. <laughs> These four friends are so tight and then you watch their whole world and each of them just like crumble apart and just desperation takes over. <laughs> There's kind of an allure to Slender Man. There's something about him that pulls you in and that part to me is terrifying. He enters your psyche and he never lets go. He's like a parasite on your brain. He has no fear because he's the fear. <laughs> Oh my God! Oh my God! Well, it's a classic story of uh, four girls uh, that uh, become curious about Slender Man and decide to do research and end up falling down the rabbit hole. It's Hallie, Ren, Chloe, and Katie, and we've been friends for a really long time. All right here it is. How to summon Slender Man? The fact that like all of us vibe together so well, it comes across in the film that like we're buddies. When people see this film, my hope is that they are looking under their bed before, before they go to bed, look in their closet, afraid to close the door while taking a shower. I want these people to be terrified. I hope I scare the shit out of them, first and foremost. And I hope they get scared, and I feel terrible for saying that, but I, I hope they get scared. I hope they're kind of seduced by the, the myth, the mystery of Slender Man. I know all the behind the scenes stuff that's happening. I'm going home at night checking my closet. Hi guys, here's today's daily fact. After terrifying audiences in 2017, Pennywise the Clown will soon return to the big screen, this time haunting the Losers Club, who is nearly 30 years older and is portrayed by a stellar cast that includes James McAvoy and Jessica Chastain. Remember to click below to subscribe or on the side for more great content.